Welcome to the Worldwide Center of Mathematics. Today I'm going to be explaining a few basic tips and tricks for taking the ACT and SAT math sections. So our first tip is to prepare outside the exam. So this includes doing practice problems before the day of the test. One of the best ways to prepare yourself for the problems that you'll see on the ACT and SAT math sections is to just do as many problems as you can find. So the College Board website has, uh, has passed ACT and SAT exams as well as practice tests available for anyone to use. Uh, you can also visit our SAT problems playlist by clicking on this button in the video uh, to view sample problems that our interns have created where you can actually watch us solving the problem on the blackboard. You can also vis visit our ACT problems playlist. Our second tip is to use the multiple choice. So don't be afraid to use the multiple choice. On the ACT and SAT math sections, most commonly you'll find a question followed by a set of five multiple choice answers. And sometimes the fastest way to solve this question is to take one of your five answer choices, plug it into whatever equation that the question gives you, and move on to the next choice if that wasn't correct. So often you'll be using choice A, choice B, choice C, choice D, and choice E in an equation that the, that the question gives you, just trying to find the correct answer. Our third tip is to skip problems. So the ACT and SAT math sections are really about managing your time. So if you've found that you're staying too long on one particular problem, that it's giving you a lot of trouble, skip it. Mark it in your test booklet that you did skip it and move on to the next question. You'll find that if you can solve the rest of your questions and you have a little bit of time left, you can go back to that problem without messing up your time management for the later problems in the booklet. So if you'd like to visit more problems or more test tips for the SAT and ACT, there is a blog post available on centerofmathematics.blogspot.com. There's going to be a link in the description of this video to the blog post describing more tips and tricks. You can also visit our test tips playlist by clicking on this blue button. And as a reminder, visit our SAT problems playlist and our ACT problems playlist. You can also find Center of Math on your favorite social media outlet.